Hello, Rula. Oh, wow. If you have Rula in your top three archetypes, listen up and let's see if any of this resonates with you. Your desire to succeed is huge. Um, sometimes you don't feel satisfied. You don't feel like you've made enough, though, that you don't feel like you are getting where you want to be. You're continuously challenging yourself to achieve higher financial goals. Um, business or work dominates most of your attention. Um, and you can fear that if you lost all your money, if you lost your power, you'd also lose your identity as well. Uh, you hide that feeling now of not being good enough um, through overachieving and through ambition and that quest for more. <laughs> you're a natural, natural leader, you're passionate, you make people want to follow you and you've got all that kind of prestige and reputation that comes with that. And that you believe that what you're creating now is going to bring you future happiness and that can drive you to that overworking so you thrive in creative innovative environments you want to build something which is of lasting value and you want to feel like you are safe and protected from financial insecurity as well like i say that desire to achieve is big you are an unstoppable force <laughs> Among your strengths, you are courageous, you are visionary, and you are determined with a capital D. <laughs> you have massive, massive gifts. You are creating an empire where everybody thrives. Because it's not just about you getting ahead and pushing everybody down. You want to bring everyone up there with you. Um, you love creating innovative, new and exciting opportunities. You love giving value. You love being this big supporting leader. So good. So um, unfortunately, all of this can come with some challenges as well. Sometimes rulers are so hell bent on creating future security that they forget to enjoy what they have right now. You're always chasing a moving money target. There's always a higher bar being set, a higher goal to be hit. Um, and that can also make you feel like there's never enough money. Like you're just kind of constantly going, you're going, you're going, you're going, and there's never enough, there's never enough, there is never enough. <sighs> but this is all good because once you get an idea of how to work with your challenges, you can create um, this prosperous, graceful, easy leadership life for yourself. And I've got a question for you. So if you are challenged to create a life's worth of wealth in the next 12 months, what would you let go of? And what would you embrace? So if you were to create a life's worth of, of wealth and you were going to do it in 12 months, what would you let go of and what would you embrace? Hmm. You have a ponder on that ruler and I'll catch you next time.